calculate the cost of cement sand and aggregate for a floor so in this video we will be calculating the cost of cement sand and aggregate required for a floor make sure to subscribe to our youtube channel and like this video thank you so much so first of all we have to find out the quantity of cement sand and aggregate that will be required Let's take an example of a concrete floor plan, the length of which is 20 feet. The breadth is also 20 feet. And the depth is 0.5 feet. So the total volume of the floor will be length multiplied by breadth multiplied by depth. So this will become 20 multiplied by 20 multiplied by 0.5 So volume will be equal to 200 cubic feet So this is the weight volume Let's convert this weight volume into dry volume for the dry volume as we know that the dry volume is equal to weight volume multiplied by 1.54 so this is equal to 200 multiplied by 1.54 which is equal to 308 cubic feet so this is the dry volume we have calculated after a calculation of the dry volume so we will be using the concrete grade ratio 1 ratio 2 ratio 4 the sum of which is equal to 7 so 1 denotes the cement 2 is the sand and 4 is the ratio of aggregate so we have the formula for volume of the cement we will use 1 divided by the total ratio which is 7 multiplied by dry volume so this will give you the volume of cement that is required so this is 1 divided by 7 multiplied by 300 So this is equal to 44 cubic feet. Let's convert this into cement bags. So how many cement bags will be required? So volume of one cement bag is equal to 1.25 cubic feet. So as we have the formula volume of cement divided by volume of one bag. So the volume which is 45, 44 divided by 1.25 this will give you 35.2 bags this means that 35.2 bags of cement will be required for this given floor after calculating the volume of cement let's calculate the volume of sand The volume of sand again we will take the ratio which is 2 the sand is uh, 2 in the ratio and divide by the total ratio which is 7 multiplied by dry volume so 2 divided by 7 multiplied by 150.92 so this will give you 43.12 cubic feet so this is the volume of the sand let's find out the volume of aggregate again for the aggregate the aggregate is in the ratio that is 4 so we will take 4 divided by the total ratio which is 7 so the formula will become 4 divided by 7 multiplied by the dry volume So 
so let's put the values 4 divided by 7 multiplied by 150.92 so this will give you 86.24 cubic feet let's find out the volume of the cast after finding out the volume of cement sand and aggregate let's find out the cost of the, these materials so first of all we will find out the cost of cement how many cement bag will be required we just calculated that is 35.2 one cement bag price we will take it from the market let's suppose that is a 610 so the cost of cement will be 35.2 multiplied by 610 so this will give you the total cost of the cement that will be required so let's calculate the cost of the sand So again for the sand uh, we will take the price of the sand in cubic feet that is required which is we calculated we will need 43.12 cubic feet so one cubic feet sand we will take the price from the market let's suppose the price is 15 So the cost of the sand will become 43.12 multiplied by 15 which is equal to 647 after that let's Calculate the cost of aggregate. So, aggre aggregate required, we just calculated, which is 86.24 cubic feet. We will take the price for 1 cubic feet of aggregate from the market. Let's suppose the price is 25. cost of aggregate will become 86.24 multiplied by 25 which is equal to 2157 so the total cost of the floor So the total cost is equal to cost of cement, sand and cost of aggregate plus manpower. So there will be also manpower working on the floor. So let's find out the cost of the manpower. Let's suppose two labor per day will be working. Uh, one labor cost you 2000 so this will become 2000. One mason per day will cost you 2000. So the total will become 4000 so for this job the total cost will become the cost of cement plus cost of sand plus the cost of aggregate plus cost of manpower so the total cost will be 28276 If you have any question, write in the comments down below. Thank you so much. For more videos like this, subscribe to our YouTube channel.
search in YouTube Civil Engineering Global and you will find it. Thank you so much.